Hi, today I want to share a new app that Sauce Lab has released for Macs. This app allows you to test your websites on different browsers and OS combinations. You can get this app for free from the App Store and once you install it, you have a choice of entering the username password that you may have already registered at SauceLabs.com or you can just try this app for free with limited functionality. The different OS and browser combinations that it supports come from the different browser types Firefox, Chrome, Opera, Safari and different versions like Firefox 3 to 17 are supported and the different OS versions. I'm going to choose to go to google.com on Firefox 8 and Windows 2012. When I click the navigate button, Source Lab is going to create a new VM from scratch for me and when my session completes then all the information that I collect is going to get de destroyed with the VM. So from that standpoint it's a little secure and I feel a little more comfortable using their service. As, as you can see the VM got created pretty quickly and the browser is already open for me and the URL already uh, navigated. So now all I have to do is start interacting with it like it would, it's a local machine for me. I'm going to type in QA automation which is my search keyword and use the mouse to click and scroll. So all actions that are possible on a local machine is possible to do perform on the VM. So you're simulating an end user experience. I'm going to now look for a bug on my blog site. I'm going to choose a blog that I posted a little while ago and I can see now that there is an alignment problem. So the next thing that I want to do is create a screenshot. Once I click submit, Source Labs takes the screenshots and makes it available for me for future reference using this URL. Now that I have tested this on one resolution, I might want to use, check it on different versions, on different screen resolutions and I'm going to do that by clicking the 1280 by 1024 option and then I'm going to maximize my window to see how it appears. As you can see with this version of the client, portion of the screen gets cut off. Hopefully over time Source Labs will fix this problem, but for now I can still uh, look at my browser with the new resolution and see that the alignment problem was only with a smaller resolution. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to end this session and that's primarily because m with my free account I am allowed only one active session at a time. I'm going to now look at how my website appears on the iPhone. This time Source Lab is going to create a new VM with OS X and the iPhone simulator installed on it. I noticed that this combination takes a little longer to uh, spin up. Once the VM is created, the simulator will appear by default and the URL that I had specified already navigated to within the inbuilt browser. So this is now up and I'm going to start interacting with the simulator. I can now interact with the simulator using my keyboard or my mouse. So as you can see you can do a lot of browser based testing even on your device and you can also upload your own apps. For that you would have to first register yourself at sauceless.com and using something called Source Connect, you can install your app and access it from here. Hopefully this demonstration is something that you find useful and you can start doing more testing using this new app. Thank you for your time.